What's going on Zen Dude Nation? Hope you guys are doing well. So the video that you're about to watch is part of a new series that Brandon and I are doing. It's a seven day challenge. Um, I just wanna be upfront in saying that this is for our app that is gonna be released in about probably six to eight weeks. And we're super, super excited about it. Um, so we just wanted to let you guys know that this is definitely more of a beginner um, tutorial and challenge. And we wanted to make those aware in our community who are a little bit more advanced and have been following Zen Dude Fitness for a while. Um, if you feel you're past the beginner level, don't worry about this next, these next seven days of videos because it's mainly for helping those very, very beginners uh, come on board. If you're an advanced member of the community, be sure to check out our Samurai series, also our Ninja series, and some of the other more advanced tutorials on this. But I just wanted to give you guys that heads up so you weren't like, dude, why are you guys doing another beginner's tutorial? It's for the app that's coming out that we're super psyched about. Um, so check out the video, leave comments, and let's keep doing the things, Zendu Nation. Myself, Brandon, the other dude, Dan, he's gonna show up here tomorrow, he's gonna coach you up. We're here today to teach you how to jump rope. Now over the next seven days, you're gonna get a little tutorial each day with a little short workout that's gonna give you the steps to jump rope over the next seven days. Don't worry about having to do any fancy tricks right now. We're gonna start with the basics and take it slow. So get ready, and let's hop into it. Now, as we get into this video, I'm gonna assume that you already have a jump rope and it's already sized correctly. If you don't have a jump rope and it's not sized correctly, then we have videos on YouTube to teach you that. Now, what we want you to understand about jump rope is it's not like running, it's not like a lot of other cardio like bicycle riding like this is a skill that you're gonna learn all right you aren't gonna be an expert the first day you try to jump rope but it's a skill that you can learn with us throughout this challenge and you can get continually better and better at as you practice so have fun with this gamify it don't put pressure on yourself don't get frustrated just go with the flow and let's take this one step at a time the first thing we're gonna focus on today is getting your rhythm down so we're not using any jump rope and we're just going to bounce our feet and get ourselves in a nice jump rope rhythm this is gonna be the same rhythm you're gonna use when you bring in the jump rope and do jump rope regular bounce. All right, ladies and gentlemen, finding your rhythm. This is the first and most important part of understanding how to jump rope because jump rope, guys, is all just a rhythm. You're just skipping the rope and you want your feet to be in tune with the rope. So as you can see, Brandon here is doing a simple practice that we recommend for everyone who's starting out, just jumping up and down on his toes and counting that rhythm. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. See that how it's nice and fluid? His knees are slightly bent and his toes are on the ground, but really guys, what we wanna focus on in this video specifically is just the rhythm and getting that one, two, three, four into your head and associating that with, with the skip of the rope. We're trying to do things very basic here and keep it pretty simple for these first few videos. Now that you've got the rhythm down, we're gonna bring in the jump rope, and what you wanna do is focus on bringing that same rhythm you had without the rope in with the rope now. So we're not doing double jumps, we're not trying to jump twice before we skip the rope underneath our feet again. We're just doing one skip with one jump over and over. All right guys, now we're gonna go ahead and incorporate the rope in. So, all Brandon's doing here is he's still keeping that rhythm. Look how symmetrical his body is. Now we'll talk about his other form in a different video, but for his rhythm, it's nearly perfect. If you can see here, Brandon's feet are coming the same height off the ground each time, and they're hitting the ground at the same exact time. I gotta say, good job B, that form is pretty flawless. That's exactly what you guys want it to look like. That nice fluid, nice fluid rhythm. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. You see that? Nice and fluid guys. So make sure to practice. Up next, we have a little workout for you guys to practice this two sets of 30 seconds with a 10 second rest in between. Make sure to check this out. Make sure to practice before watching tomorrow's video. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so here we're just practicing. Um, I'm having you guys do this twice, so two circuits of 30 seconds, but you could also, if you're an overachiever and you need to practice, do this four times, okay? So I'll do the first two with you guys, and if you're feeling a little bit advanced and like you wanna learn faster, then do four, challenge yourself. But again, Brandon's form is pretty much impeccable here. Notice throughout this, uh, this whole thing, all I want you guys to focus on uh, before we get into the other things is his rhythm. It's literally perfect. One, two, three, four. It never, ever changes. And that's very important to look out for, guys. 
Last set here, jump rope, regular bounce, jump rope, regular bounce. We're not going for speed, we're not going for tricks. We are literally going for exactly how you see Brandon doing this. Find your rhythm. You know what helps me a lot? Listening to music, particularly hip hop, um, gets me into my rhythm and helps me jump rope a lot better. So if you have a favorite kind of music, it's a good way to get your feet working in the same rhythm and to provide a little bit more intensity and motivation and fun to your workouts. You guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure to come back tomorrow and watch day two of this seven day beginner jump rope challenge.